Good evening, good day, good morning, whenever you're watching this video. I'm going to talk about the pain, what a pain is and how to work with the pain. We all can work with the pain because pain is a symptom of our body and our body communicates with us and needs our attention. When the body needs attention is when we are in imbalance within our journey, within our purpose, within our um, highest good. So when you're going around, you know, like away from this trajectory, then the body, you know, like talking to you, you know, like through all the symptoms, you know, in the body. Yeah. And it can be whatever. Yeah. Pain is actually the urge, it's like urgency, it's like emergency, you know, and it talk to you, you know, like you didn't care about the symptoms, you know, and talks or signals I gave you before. So now, you know, this is acute, you need to, you know, like deal with this. This is what is a pain about. So when you are in the pain of something, you know, depends of intensity also, it always comes, you know, like with a low intensity. And then if we don't care, we don't give attention to it, you know, we don't want to give it because everything is important than us, then, you know, intensity is growing. <laughs> so the pain, uh, you can read many, many things on internet when the pain and how it was created, you know, from the physical um, perspective. So it works with our nerve system. So whenever our tissue is actually broken, already you know then start to uh, because we have uh, neurology and nerve system you know like uh, everywhere so then um, you know the pain you know uh, central in our brain midbrain especially you know like signalize us there is something you know in enlightenment with us so the perfect thank you you know we need to always like thanks you know to communication with our body but we do not understand that what we do we do take painkillers but this video for the people, they do not take me um, painkillers um, or they fed up of that or it doesn't work anymore. So there is a way how to work with your body. And so it means there is something in enlightenment and we need to work with that. We need to remove that in order that the body can actually work itself perfectly because the body does for us and heal and 24 seven, right? Yeah, it, it does. In all your immune system, every system in your body works for you 24 7 you know so your body is your friend from this perspective the pain is actually the urge of your body to take um, attention to something yeah so you have a pain you know where in the body it is yeah so uh, the, the technique i'm gonna just show you works originally uh i got this technique uh from webinar of yvette uh, rose and um, I'm using this and it works with me perfectly. Um, yeah, I have some other technique, those works well, but I would like now introduce this technique. Um, it's very easy and also the techniques that um, allow you and introduce you to work in your body, yeah? Connect with your body and train your intuition, train your inner, inner wisdom. Uh, let's say everyone can do that I was able to do that everyone can do that right so the first thing is actually what you're gonna to work with it's gonna be the place in the body we're gonna give intention to it you know and our focus and um, and the pain yeah sort of if you do not have a pain in that place uh, and you want to work with some uh, kind of um, um for example organ there is no pain but you know like it's still functional dysfunction or it doesn't work yeah or you can even work with uh, any kind of organs tissue or system in your body yeah in order to reconnect you know with that and get information from that system organ place yeah, I really do not, do not mind. So in the order, we need to actually to identify where in the body it is, where we're going to, because we're going to, to, to give it a, our um, focus. What is the focus, you know? Like when you focus your um, intention, 
yeah this is technology you're gonna use you're gonna use yourself you're gonna use the quiet room you know like some time you know that you don't in that room you don't gonna be uh disturbed and it's gonna be your intention you're gonna heal yeah something or to get information about something your focus and uh, dedication yeah you are all technology yeah you love yourself you set up the room you set up everything you know and whenever we are working on ourselves we're giving dedication and for focus to it you know that's everything what it requires if it doesn't gonna happen on the first place then so what <laughs> yeah you didn't start to walk straight away you know you did you know baby step you fall down you know and then stand up and try it again so this is actually what is gonna happen with you and this is the technology or the mortality or the technique you know how to work with the pain I may probably you know like don't do that exactly how I was learned that but this is you know like I never do exactly the things you know I'm using what works with me so we're going for we're going to uh, to prepare for uh, healing for working with the pain and I recommend to you you know to relax uh, your body before that and it can be by deep inhale and exhale or to just mentally go in your you know like uh, central or whatever works with you you can make even the uh, short meditation before so please be be yourself whatever works with you it is the perfect way yeah if you want to sing if you want to run before i really don't mind right and then what i do i do always a protection so um i don't use any kind of uh, waterfall of the water you know in fact I, I don't like using any kind of external stuff you know we are sovereign beings and we have everything within us so i'm using after the power of my love and the power of my heart yeah so as a protection you know like we're gonna be safe and uh, we can have uh, a space cap during work with ourselves it's this one uh we're gonna connect with that place you know an energy of love within your heart or in the area behind your um uh, chest bone um and you can actually just focus you know your intention you know like go by inner inner uh sign you know mentally in that place you can close your eyes it usually helps it, it works works with me all the time you know i can much more you know um uh, be better at what i do you know when i close my eyes so i can concentrate and give it a hundred percent so we're gonna connect to the area of our heart you know it's inside it's in this area you know but whatever if you have a feeling you want to go here because for example i do have there my uh core star my chakra system is removed so i have in this place you know my core star so i really leave that with you you can go with the divine love you can your inner love you know to make a, a secret or safe space you know for work with within yourself it's gonna protect you from an energetic um uh perspective so when you connect to that spark in your heart and you just know you're connected with that because you know yourself you know where you have a heart you know there is a love and i want you just connect with that and if you need to take a deep inhale and exhale just just simply do do whatever it takes And I want you now expand that love from over your heart area or area in your center of the body, wherever are you working, and expand it way beyond your heart, your body, and stretch it out beyond the room. You are sitting right now and mentally just fix it as a bubble you know or the square or the shape of your room 
that those are, those are the boundaries that no one is going to break during work, your, your sacred work within yourself. Right, so we are now protected and if you didn't feel something, you don't know what to do, just, just know, you know, it's going to happen, you know, just set it up, you know, it's going to be better for you because you decided so, yeah, and you are very strong and powerful. And I want you now just uh, to go in that place of your pain and we're going now by your intention and focus and we're going to stay there for two, three minutes. and observe what is happening there you can feel because you are there with your intention you can feel any kind of sensation tingling some movement silence When you are in that pain, you probably go beyond that pain. You can realize that the pain actually like opened the door for you, you're going more deeper. And you may gain full awareness what emotion, situation is stored there. Or a message from the body what kind of disbalance occurred and why and we don't get in anything it will perfect just stay there without any expectations be in the space of the pain in your body and go deeper if you can Go deeper, deeper, as far as you can and stay there. You can get some flashes of situations, it's perfect. You're just coming into contact with that information, with that space. And whatever you get, It's okay. And now, when you are, you, you're gonna stay in the space of the pain whenever you are now you're gonna work there and so we all the time gonna be there we're gonna set up now very strong intention with the focus your focus is like a force yeah and intention is gonna what command you want you know to be healed it's like release that disbalance heal and rebalance that area So you want to release, heal, and rebalance. We're going to stay for the next 2-3 minutes with our full focus on in, with intention to heal, rebalance after it is released. So we can repeat it, release, heal, rebalance. And today we're going to stay there for two, three minutes, but in the fact you can stay longer, you're going to stay in the fact until you have sensation and feeling, you know, that space was actually relaxed, released, awakened, light, cleared. Leave that with you, whatever works with you is perfect. 
and just gonna be some uh, energy change for fucking for fuck. <sighs> With every release, you can have an exhale. You can cry. Your body can react anyway. Just allow it. Whatever it's happened, allow it to happen. So now we're gonna continue and when this is actually uh, released and cleared, we're gonna set up intention. And this other intention is about accepting with the ease and grace awareness, any awareness of message you may got, you know, and obtained, obtained, you know, in that situation, within that system. Whatever you get there, you can obtain any message awareness, yeah? Or you just know what's happened, you know. So subconsciously, you know. So you're gonna set up intention now. I accept with ease and grace any awareness message I obtain. And we're gonna stay there another two, three minutes. With repeating actually the command, our intent, what body needs to do when we particle the subconscious we know what and we're gonna I accept with the grace and ease I accept with the ease I accept with the ease and grace any message awareness I have just received I accept with ease and grace all awareness and message I have just received. This is it. And again, you can have any kind of feeling in the body. Just follow your body, help your body to release, to accept. To change and it's slightly gonna move forward and now we're gonna to do the last intention and it's gonna be gonna set this intention for us is like a command and we're gonna talk to our ourself, to our body and every cell of the body is listening now that I do not need fight anymore for my value. I can just have it. And you can repeat it again and again. We're gonna stay here for a while. I do not need fight anymore for my value. I can just have it. I don't need any more to fight for my value. I can just have it. You can simply just have it. You don't need any more to fight for that. You don't need any more to fight for your value. You can just have it. So you can stay now repeating this one silently or loudly to yourself until you feel well. Until that place feels well. And in general, actually, all your body will feel very well when it starts to work. When you don't need to fight anymore for your value, can you imagine? 
all your life you've been holding them and fight for your value just let it go you don't need that it's time now is the time to let it go to love yourself enough to do it <laughs> Now we can move to the other part. Which is actually breathing. It's a breathing technique that is gonna help to integrate the change that just happened in your system. And you did a great job, you did in your work. You did a serious work now. And whatever you ask the body, body did it for you. So now we're gonna fix it, yeah? And we're gonna be permanent now. So I'm gonna to do it, you know, by the breathing technique. And we're gonna actually breathe by our mouth, you know, we're gonna inhale in and exhale out by our mouth. I'm gonna show you. This is gonna be one, yeah? This is gonna inhale and exhale. And we're gonna do, you know, this uh, in the row, you know, 14 times. On the 40 times, you're gonna hold your breath in and wait until it's uh, comfortable and you can, you know, and then after you're ready to exhale your first breath, you're going to do it by mouth out. And you're going to stay in that state and enjoy that state. It's going to be a little bit uh, probably um, uncomfortable because your body will be, you know, like energy will be like tingling. But all is perfect, yeah? So we're starting now. We're going to breathe in 13 times, you know, by mouth in and out. So one. Two, three, four, fifth, six, seven, you can feel heat, eight, in, eight, nine, your process, your divine process. And everything is perfect. You can even leave your body now like my soul is leaving. Extending my body. Feeling happy. So now the energies, you know, are working, going in the waves where the bro blockages was before. And they can run, you know, in the place they haven't been before and connect with the others and push others, you know, and the new neural waves are active. Everywhere where it was like switch off the light now is going on in your body energetically, in your neurology, neural system. This is just happening now, you know, like all information would just, would, would just now happen. You know, it's going to be fixed, move the information everywhere. And you're going to put in the work again, the system that hasn't been working for a while. Because what was there in the way was removed. <sighs> and you can always take a deep inhale and exhale. The exhale only just help you to release. It's just helping the body to work for you. It's absolutely perfect. And if you're still feeling the pain on the place, it's okay. You will go there again and you will, you know, do the same procedure again until you know all the pain is up here and the body doesn't have any more message for you 
and just be really happy and great, grateful for what you've done just so far now because you did a lot for you just listening this one with me you give it a chance the body to heal you give it a chance the body to learn something you can use anytime it's coming for any kind of blockage pain or you just can get some information from your organ systems if they are not working or there are no enlightenment and whenever your 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 energy sit down you know and you become more neutral relax then we're gonna ground more ourselves by giving our attention and focus to the bottom of your feet on, on the floor if you have crossed legs or in the air so you just give uh, intention and focus you know to this part of your legs and and the air or the floor or the earth then we're gonna connect with the mother earth with the mother nurture with the mother stability with the mother of the place of everything of you When you feel, you know, your energy there and your grounding, feel the perfect, you know, that lovely nurturing, a strong feeling from the mother or from the air, as a mother or in one. And just bring your awareness to your heart whenever you are started. Awareness. And we'll come back. Here and now. And just let me tell you, you are so amazing. You are so wonderful. I'm so grateful, you know, like you allow yourself, you know, like to evolve a little bit more and connect with your body and listen to message from your body. And if you do you think like nothing happened, just give it a time. Two, three days and do it again. And if you have any question or do you wanna ask me something, just feel free you not know, to leave the message be below this video. And um, if you want to something to share with me, what's happened, um, more than open and happy to see your comment also. I love you so much. I wish you all the best. And I wish you are, you are, able to communicate with your body with ease and grace and remember it uh, requires a little bit patience and practice and your fully awareness focus and dedication that's only you know what you need to do and um, if you love yourself like yeah prove it but you can do it and you are good enough to do it yeah okay namaste